Hello, 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 hello. Check out the question that is behind me. Do you think zero over zero is equal to two? What can you say about this? Is this true? Mm. In mathematics, when you have a zero as a denominator here, it's undefined. But look at this. Zero divided by zero is equal to two. We have to prove. Okay. So, uh, don't say it's not there in mathematics. It's there. This is how, or this is what makes people think mathematics is difficult. So, you need to think outside the box. How can you show that zero over zero is equal to two? So, we go like this. I'm going to say four minus four over four minus four. We know that when we say four minus four, it is giving us a zero, and this is a zero we have. Four minus four, it's also a zero. This is a zero that we, we have. So here, I'm going to apply difference of two squares on top. Down here, I'm going to do factorization. So difference of two squares, this is how it will look like. Like that. We know that two power two is four. Two power two is also four. And then I say over. Here, factorization, I'll write a 2 here, and then I shall remain with a 2 minus 2. So what we have here is the same as this, and what we have here is the same as that, this. Now, here, difference of two squares, it will be 2 minus 2, 2 plus a 2 there, and over 2, 2 minus a 2. I think now you get the picture where it's going. So this and this would disappear there. We shall remain with a 2 plus a 2 over a 2. So what is 2 plus 2? That is a 4 over a 2, which is giving us what? A 2. 2 into 2, 1 into 4, it's a 2. And this is a 2 that we have. Hence, hence 0 over 0 is equal to a 2. We've gotten it. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Sichamba Jacob. Please remember to follow me on my Facebook page, Jacob Sichamba Online Math, on my YouTube channel, Jacob Sichamba Online Math, and also on my TikTok. Bye-bye.